today we are going to do experiment 8 this is the decomposition of the hydrogen peroxide so we're gonna do first trial and second trial for you this is what the material we need is we need a 1 molar Ki potassium iodide 3% hydrogen peroxide sidearm flask uh, graduate cylinder and a container and we need to stand with the clamp so we fill out the container with uh, deionized water so right now we're gonna submerge the grad cylinder make sure no, yeah. and fill it up with water make sure there is no bubble Gonna stand it up, uh, make it stand like that. We're gonna clamp the cylinder. Like so. Make sure you have enough room on the bottom. Yeah. For Oops, I got any above. Next, we're going to place the tubing inside the grad cylinder like so. And now we're going to connect it to the sidearm flask. Make sure it's close. And we need to make sure that you put stopper on it, like so. So we're gonna measure 5 milliliter of the hydrogen peroxide, the 3%. And we're gonna wait. Zero First eight. stir it, zero it, and then And then you're gonna pour that into the flask and immediately cap it. Reweigh this one. Now we have to weigh the empty. Zero. Make a zero this one. We tear it again. And measure the empty grad cell. Now we're going to measure the potassium iodide, the catalyst. Is it 10 mil? Yes. So we're measuring 10 mil of the potassium iodide. That's one molar, so it's pretty concentrated. So this is, we're going to start the reaction. You're going to pour it in. As we see here, still a full of water, and then we're shaking get the start a reaction started see there, there there you go there's a gas form from the reaction can you make it lower We can give them an example of the one. Yeah. So 
it, so it continues to produce the, the bubble. This takes about 10 to 15 minutes. We're going to continue. So we're going to continue doing that and we're going to fast forward. So this is at the end of the about 10, 15, 15 minutes. Um, we're reading that. So the, it's what? 40? 40. So it's 40 mil of gas been produced. Yes. Um, we also want to let you know the current barometric pressure is 759.7 millimeter mercury and the temperature in this room is 22.0 degrees Celsius.